13 years ago when I first met you, uh, communicating, you, you touched on this, I want to get into a little bit more, communicating as a politician 13 years ago and communicating as a politician today, what has changed? I think uh, the thing that has changed is that 13 years ago, it was a very deep communication. You know, uh, the communication was uh, more serious than today. Today, communication is more about perception. I mean, what point you make? So, there is so much to consume. Yeah. So, you know, people have a very short memory today. Because every second they have something to consume. Either on their mobile or on the TV or on some other media. So, today, it is about making your point. That's all. And for that, do you feel that you need to become louder and louder? I mean, do you feel that there's a competition that you have with yourself? No. I have got to be more, you know, sensational. I'm, I'm speaking almost as a news person, but it's because politician, politics and news goes quite hand in hand. So we also then seem that the industry, news industry gets louder and louder. And I, I don't think you have to be louder, but you have to be smarter. It is a time when the communication has to be very smart. And of course... Smart communication means creating few sensations. But if you just go on creating sensation and that sensation is not backed by your action, then people will not believe in you. So every thing which you portray must be backed by action. So I think that is the key today. 